Hey everybody, Haiti Chat It All here. So, it's been a couple weeks since the last video that I made, and I'm so sorry I've been away. I have just been with trying to do my thing with school and working more often, trying to pick up some hours before the summer's here. And um, that's really what I've been doing. I haven't been doing much with my hair. So I really didn't see the need to make a lot of videos. Plus, um, I haven't bought anything also. I've been trying to save up my money so I can do whatever I want with it. Um, also, I have been wearing my hair in twist outs this week. Um, I'll twist it up for work and then probably take it out when I go to class or something like that. Because at my job, I do have to wear a hat. So trying to do a bunch of things with my hair doesn't really, isn't, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, well, it just doesn't make sense to try and do. So I keep it really simple and just wear my hair in twists. Also, um, with my workouts and the Team Sexy Back Challenge, it ended April 6th. However, I'm still working out. Um, I'm probably going to up my workouts as far as like intensity and time because I think my body's getting used to what I'm doing. And that's not really, I don't want to be steady at where I'm at right now. I really just want to let it all go. Like, all of it. Not all of it. Some of it's good, but <laughs> just the parts I don't want. Um, I actually worked out this morning, and with me waking up late sometimes and just laying in the bed, it's not even waking up, it's getting out of the bed that I have problems with. And, um, with doing that, it kind of throws off my eating schedule and my workout schedule, so I think I have to work with myself on motivating myself to get up, motivating myself to get up. But, um, also... In two days, it'll be one year since the last time I used heat on my hair and it was flat iron. I'm actually going to insert a pic right about, not now, but after I say this, um, of what my hair looked like when it was flat ironed. So this is when I flat ironed it and the last time I flat ironed it. Also, um, July will be, I think, I believe it's July 2nd, is the day that I big chop, so it'll be three years. Um, I'm hoping the growth of my hair continues to do its thing and kind of increase. I know with my heat damage and me cutting it and um, trying to figure out what works for me has probably been stunning my growth a little bit. But, um, hey, you live and you learn, and that's what this journey is really about. Also, what else? I found a wig that I want to purchase. And when I do get it, I will let you guys know. I'm really excited. This, it will be a lace front, so it'll be my first lace front ever in life. And I'm really excited. I'm really excited. So that's going to be probably my first purchase next to clothes that I'll be getting. Um, maybe in May. I th yeah, I don't think I'm going to spend any money unless it's for food in April. So um, there's that. And I really believe that's it. Let me give you guys a close up of what my hair looks like today. It really is just kind of... Um, what is it? It's, I don't know. It's basically, yeah, I put it in chunky twist last night. So this is what it looks like up close. So this is how it came out this morning. I just put some coconut oil and did my thing. Um, yeah, it was about, I believe, two, four, six, eight, eight twists. No. Two, four. 
10, 10 twists and they were kind of chunky, but I think it came out pretty nice, don't you think? Also, I don't believe I made a new video with my new glasses. Look at these babies. They have circles on the side. I love these. I love them. They give me so much life. You guys have no idea. But anyway, that's pretty much all I had to say. Those are my updates on how everything's been going. I may do a tutorial um, on how I do my twist outs and basically kind of the method that I use. It's not really a method, but they tend to come out really defined, so I want to show you guys that. And I think that's about it. So I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Much love. Bye.